Assalamu alaikum my dear students. Ladies and gentlemen, we are once again together so we can conclude this discussion on self-awareness this session. We would like to see why this skill is so important and then I would like to share with you that research paper where you will read and see how this developing the management skill where self-awareness is one of them relates with the uh, financial gain and the financial productivity of you and me, all of us. And at the same time, uh, taking this self-awareness and putting it into practice and seeing that at the managerial level, what kind of dilemmas we can face. So are you ready then? Let me welcome you. Be ready so that we can conclude the discussion on self-awareness and learn its importance. And ये भी मैं आपसे शेयर कर लूँ कि इस सेशन में कुछ आपको असाइनमेंट्स और काम करने का मौका भी मिलेगा, कुछ सबमिशंस होंगी जो आपको इस कोर्स के हवाले से सबमिट करनी होंगी। I'll give you time, and within that time you will carry out that assignment and submit, so a grade can be awarded to you. Naturally, this grade. It's not like A, B, C, what you get in a course, but this grade tells us that you have taken, you have taken the uh, assignment and given importance to it, and at the same time, you're trying to make sure that you are learning and moving together. ठीक है? So are you ready then? Let me move on and show you this slide once again. इससे पहले भी मैंने आपको ये किताब में से ये स्लाइड लेकर दिखाई थी कि यस व्हाट यू सी एज अ सिम्टम फॉर एग्जांपल यू आर नॉट एबल टू मैनेज योर स्ट्रेस एंड यू बिकम अ स्ट्रेसफुल पर्सन यू क्रिएट स्ट्रेस अराउंड यू यू आर नॉट एबल टू कोप अप विद द टाइम दोज आर सिम्टम्स प्रॉब्लम कहां पर है सेल्फ अवेयरनेस में हाउ आर यू गोइंग टू मैनेज दैट how are you going to prioritize your goals? So in other words, knowing about the self-awareness importance gives you a strategic lever, a long-term focus. And of course, managing stress and managing time would be at the tactical level. This means, it's a Spanish proverb, self-knowledge is a beginning. My dear student, it's a beginning of self-improvement and when we speak of and when we speak of self-improvement this means now we know where we are weak now we know where the strength has to be even more strengthened now we know that what goals are and what resources would be expected from me in terms of talent in terms of ability in terms of communication in terms of perseverance so many of them. So you can make a plan, improvement plan. We'll talk about that. Personal, aapse already share ho chuka hai, management development plan. Let me also introduce another window known as Johari window. You might have studied about this concept in OB course in communication. But this window taken as a model it can be used for self-awareness. It's a self-assessment technique. It helps you and me to understand the elements which make up of our own knowledge about ourselves. And the possibility of the development of the self-awareness. See, this is a model. Basically, it's a model. Let's take a look on this model. On the x-axis, please notice what is written? Something which is known to others and something which is unknown to others. Remember we were talking about looking glass test? How people would give you feedback? What they see of you? What is visible to them? 
how they perceive about you. It's very important. So this model, this window, it opens up a window. Aap keh lijiye, this window opens into your brain, into your thinking apparatus, right or left brain, or maybe this is a window to your heart. It depends how you take it. And on the x-axis, on the y-axis known to others and unknown to others, on the x-axis, we have what is known to self and what is unknown to self. Let's talk about area number one. Area number one is something, strength or weakness, ability or capability, competency or less competency or more competency, verbal skill or written skill, known to you and known to others. Open area number one. Some skill, some capability, some talent, some ability, some knowledge, some attitude, some value system, which is known to you as well as known to others. Good enough. Very visible. It's operational. Its importance is operational. Every day, every hour, every minute, like what you see of me, I see of you, the color which you see, the glasses which you see, the face which you, the computer which you see, the laptop, the way you see it, the way I see it, it's open. And certainly, there has to be certain areas which needs to be open. But something which is known to you, area number three, something which is known to you, but it is unknown to others, that's your weakness. You know it, but you are trying to present yourself in such a way that it is unknown to others. Please do not let your weakness known to others. This word is tough. They do not uh, have mercy on you. You have to have mercy on you. So what your weakness is, do you know? Do you know that you cannot speak good English? Do you know that you cannot write good English? Do you know that you learn Chinese? Do you know that you can read good Arabic and speak in Arabic? You are good in mathematics. You can use uh, uh, analytical tools. You are good in program. What are your strengths? That's known. But here comes the area weakness. I'm weak in math. Okay, good. You know it. But when there will be a situation that you are expected to know mathematics, either you make sure that you have an improvement plan or how are you going to manage it? But this is a hidden area. Yes, it is hidden from public, but it is known to you. That's what we calling your weakness. Or weakness hoti hai. Us weakness ko strength mein convert karne ka, transform karne ka kya plan hai? Farz ki ji, aap nahi kar sakte. But when it comes a time that you need to have that strength and you don't have. So what is then your execution plan? You cannot make good presentation in PowerPoint. You cannot use Excel sheet to show the data in bar chart or pie chart. Okay, you know it. But now you have been told that on Monday morning, you have to present in front of 10 people. Presentation, kisi aur se banwa lijiye. Lekin us present ko present karne ka art skill bhi seekhni padegi varna to at the time of presentation you will not be able to handle it acha chaliye phir kya karenge aap have someone around you who can handle the computer and who can watch and connect with your eyes so that change slides can be changed 
So you know your weakness. Try to overcome that weakness by managing yourself. That is self-management. Otherwise, dekhye, if I know how to make my presentation, I don't need anyone to handle uh, this laptop. I would have that wireless pointer. Having the wireless pointer, I don't need to touch this anybody. I can move around, give a good presentation. I can make the slide up and down the way I like. Wireless pointer. I don't have to touch it here. The hidden area, just come carry it. Hidden area is your weakness. And please make sure that you have a plan or you know how to manage it. The one area which is dangerous is something we call blind. It's blind. Remember the blind road? You can hit and get crashed. Unknown to self, you don't know. Unknown to self, known to others. जिसने वो हाईवे बनाई है उसको तो पता है कि ये ब्लाइंड है एंड वेन इट इज ए ब्लाइंड टर्न यू डोंट नो इट ऑल दैट इज डिफिकल्ट अनोन टू सेल्फ एंड नोन टू अदर्स द इफ दे नो इट दे विल यूज इट अगेंस्ट यू नॉट गुड प्लीज Make this blind area as minimum as possible. In other words, try to convert this blind area. देखिए ना इस वक्त तो चारों one two three four same size. क्या करेंगे आप? Blind area जो है उसका size open area से कम करेंगे? ये नहीं. Strength तो यही है ना कि आप उस blind area को blind ना रहने दें. Let it be known to self. but the one which gives you strategic importance the one which raises your market value is the area number 4 unknown to self and unknown to others now if you leave this area unknown unexploited undiscovered it is undiscovered to others but you also want to leave it undiscovered unexplored and untraveled No, that's not good. That's where self-awareness comes in. Please explore yourself. Take a dive down into your own sea. अपने मन में डूब कर. Allah Maik Bal said, "Paja surah ke zindagi." Those gems and jewels which are buried down in your own sea, please find out. Allah Taala ne बहुत सारी सलाहियतें आपको दी है एक्सप्लोर कीजिए मजीद लर्न कीजिए कन्वर्ट दिस अनोन टू सेल्फ टू नोन टू सेल्फ लेट मी शेयर विद यू वन एग्जाम्पल आई हैड अ चांस टू अटेंड अ मीटिंग इन यूनाइटेड नेशंस इन न्यूयॉर्क सो आई डिड देन आई हैड ट्रेवल टू एम आई टी आई वॉन्ट टू टेक ए कोर्स हाउ टू सॉल्व complex business problems by using complexity theory now this course is still not part of the mba curriculum aap utha ke dekh lijiye pakistan ki kisi bhi university ke curriculum ke andar nahi hai i want to know it it's an unknown area i never explored professor forrester at mit he is the one who developed MIT is known for this particular area development it has traveled from engineering to management and to solving complex business problems complexity is increasing complexity in markets complexity in supply chain complexity with the customers notice how the globalization is making the business world complex challenges are for you and for everybody the world is getting complex so to handle complex problems what are the solutions do you want to learn i said okay i want to learn unknown area unknown to others in pakistan unknown to me so i spent a time for 3 days i paid money 
sat in that course and learned how to use complexity theory without using mathematical model, how to put it into management and solve those problems of management, of business, of social science, because the problems are there and you must know how to handle it. So something which was unknown to me and unknown to others in the same arena, by learning it, I have converted this unknown area to hidden area. Hidden area. Now it's known to me, but it's unknown to others. And I will present it to the market when the market will pay me the premium price. See how you learn and how you convert and how you add value? Something which is futuristic. All of you, my dear students, learn, for example, Chinese. Take it. Take it, my advice. I think it will add value into whatever you're doing. The whole world will open. Learn Arabic. The whole world will... Learning a new language, you learn new culture, you learn new market, you learn new opportunities. Unknown area, very important. It is unknown to you. It will stay unknown to others. But please put something in it. It's a premium. It will give you value of the premium level. Blind area, no good. Chitna chota hona chahiye, utna hi better hai. Unknown area, thik hai. Futuristic skill, futuristic knowledge, new domain. Aap mein se jo marketing ke students hain, ya statistics se interest rakhte hain, let me share with you. Please learn text analytics. टेक्स्ट एनालिटिक्स अब मैंने दो लफ्ज आपको दे दिए हैं जाइए लर्न कीजिए अनोन अनोन टू यू अनोन टू अदर्स बट द वन हु विल लर्न इट बेटर एंड वेन ही गोज टू द मार्केट एंड ही टेल दैम दैट यस ओके आई कैन टेक द मार्केटिंग रिसर्च डेटा आई कैन टेक द बिजनेस रिसर्च डेटा आई कैन हैंडल नंबर नंबर हैंडलिंग नो प्रॉब्लम यू कैन यूज एक्सल शीट यू कैन यूज एस पी एस एस बट आई एम कॉम्पिटेंट टू हैंडल open ended questionnaires i can open i can handle to op, i can manage to handle text develop certain themes and patterns from the customer feedback qualitative feedback bahut sare logon ko nahi malum ab aapko kaise ye learn karna hai kaise is area ki importance hogi to dekhiye uh, management skill padhate padhate i give you certain tips where once you develop that strength I'm sure when you go to the market, the market will pay you ten thousand, fifteen thousand extra. ये वो competencies हैं, my dear students, हम आपसे share करके आए हैं जो आपको develop करनी है. Competency means you need knowledge. You have to develop an attitude. You need to develop that skill set, right? Then it becomes your competency. List is already with you, and I've shared this, the book written by Dr. Javed Lagari. आप में से कितनों ने खरीदी है ये? मिली आपको ये कॉपी अवेलेबल है पाकिस्तान में अच्छा बीटन एंड कैमरून तो ठीक है वर्चुअल यूनिवर्सिटी के जरिए से आपको फ्री मिल जाएंगे उसके चैप्टर्स भी और उसका कंटेंट भी और उसकी स्लाइड्स भी बट आई थिंक स्पेंडिंग सम मनी इन दैट एरिया विच इज अनोन टू यू रिमेंबर दैट एरिया अनोन टू अदर्स यू विल रीड यूल डेवलप एन एटीट्यूड and this book is available this has already shared with you those traits how are you going to put it together so you can be a future successful manager that's why chairman at gc dr javed lahari is saying a portion for would be leaders would be managers successful managers of pakistan all right these are the nine skills taken from the book very important skill each one of you has to develop it maine top par to communication skill ko likha hua hai lekin isme self awareness bhi hai we'll take one by one self awareness 
gives you strength inside out, then you can manage time and energy and money to put into your future. Let me share with you this instrument which I have a bit modified taken from the book. I'm calling it PAMS. Abhi tak toh aapne individual assessments ki na. This is a extensive assessment of you in all the nine or ten areas. Abhi nine areas ki aapne baat ki thi. Remember those nine areas? Should I read? Let me show you once again. These nine areas. We like to test you, assess you, measure you. Right now. So that when you go in the course and you learn the content and you find the importance, you will see where you were when you took this test, when you took this instrument, when you measured yourself for the first time. It's a personal assessment of management skills, PAMS. There are 10 skill set areas. It's a comprehensive assessment of you. It will take time. But you have to submit this to virtual university. You have to be submit, you have to submit this instrument. Soft copy is available. Aapko ek hafta diya ja hai. Within one week, you will take this Word document, fill it out, be honest with yourself, and by assessing yourself, keys already given, you will submit, and within one week, you submit to virtual university. Let me quickly just share with you the instrument which you will see when you get the Word document. This personal assessment management skill, PAMS, it will give you an overall profile of your personality. Overall profile of your level of skills in those nine or ten areas. Nine or ten competencies. You will rate, scale diya hua hai, one to six. Aram se ek hafte ka time aapke paas hai, main statements iski nahi padhunga. They are very self-explanatory. اس میں پہلا کمپوننٹ سیلف اویرنس کا ہے اور سیلف اویرنس کے پانچ سٹیٹمنٹس ہیں اور پلیز نوٹس یہ ڈاکومنٹ آپ کے پاس ہوگا اس پہ اپنا نام لکھئے ٹائم لکھئے ٹائم سے مراد ہے ڈیٹ لکھئے کہ آپ کب یہ اسیسمنٹ کر رہے ہیں اور میبی آفٹر ون منت اور ٹو منت آپ کو سبمٹ تو بات دوبارہ نہیں کرنا لیکن آفٹر ون منت اور ٹو منت میبی یو لائک ٹیک دس ٹیسٹ اگین اور سی ہ and where you have improved and where you have not improved. And maybe after one year, after five years, you will take the test again. This will be your asset taken from this course. Scale is one to six. Scale is very clear. Area one is self-awareness. Area two is managing stress and managing time. Remember, this is management skill number two. Area number three, how can you solve problems creatively and innovatively? At this time, how can you solve problem innovatively and creatively? Area number four, how can you communicate sportively? And this will include verbal, non-verbal, gestural, listening, all of it. You communicate and communicate sportively. Area number five, gaining power and influence. Very important. Achha, abhi humne inke baare mein discuss nahi kiya. Statements aapke saamne hai. You like to measure on a scale of one to six, aap aaj kahaan par hai. Gaining power and influence. Area number six, motivating others. These are all those list which are listed in the management skills. And all over the world, business organizations, managers, firms, markets, they require these skills to be developed in people, in entrepreneurs, in managers. Area number six, motivating others. Area number seven, managing conflicts. Area number eight, empowering and delegating. Area number nine, Building effective teams. And area number 10, managing change. Look, those 9, 10 skills are included in it. It's a comprehensive instrument. Almost 80 statements. It will take time. 
सो टेक योर टाइम फिल इट आउट यू हैव वन वीक टू सबमिट अच्छा फिर देखिए इसका स्कोर भी दिया हुआ है बिलो सिक्सटी परसेंट यू आर इन द बॉटम क्वार्टाइल बॉटम क्वार्टाइल सिक्सटी टू सिक्सटी फाइव यू आर इन द थर्ड क्वार्टाइल और क्वार्टाइल को भी नीचे एक्सप्लेन किया हुआ कि वट डज इट मीन एंड सिक्सटी सिक्स टू सेवेंटी परसेंट सेकेंड क्वार्टाइल एंड सेवेंटी वन परसेंट एंड अब इज यू आर इन द टॉप क्वार्टाइल बट हाउ अब यू गो यू आर ऑफकोर्स इन द टॉप क्वार्टाइल who will take who are taking or who will take uh, this kind of test theek hai my dear students you you complete it and submit it to the uh, virtual university all right after taking this test we move on and we come to a point that we assess ourselves you have one week you will have a score you will know that you are in the second or third or fourth quartile maybe are you the top and if you are in the top if you are at the 72 or 73% still there is a room even if you are at 95 still there is a room to reach at 100% right so in every case do you have your own management development plan remember earlier we talked about personal development plan now we are talking about management development plan those nine or 10 management skills which research tells us is very important so first you have a development plan i'll share with you in a minute and then please think of an implementation plan acha jo ye development plan hai ye to aapko submit karna hai implementation plan it could take week months years we leave it to you and you see that's why i was saying why this is important and why you need to learn this is the personal development plan remember i shared with you earlier aapke parents kaisi hai clothes kaise hain aap jo baithe hue hain aapke ird gird log kaise aapse comfortable feel kar rahe hain ye aapko khayal rakhna hai ye already main discussion aapse kar chuka hu i move on acha fir ab डेवलपमेंट क्या है और दो से तीन सालों में क्या है नाउ आई कम टू द मैनेजमेंट डेवलपमेंट प्लान नंबर वन कम्युनिकेशन स्किल्स वर्बल नॉन वर्बल रिटर्न लिसनिंग स्पीकिंग वेर आर यू नाउ एट दिस पॉइंट इन टाइम वेन यू आर टेकिंग दिस कोर्स नाउ इसलिए दिस हैज टू बी सबमिटेड अच्छा इसके लिए हम आपको दो हफ्ते दे रहे हैं अब देखिए अब आपका काम शुरू हो रहा है यू हैव टू पुट योर हैंड्स ऑन योर माइंड ऑन योर हार्ट ऑन टू बी सबमिटेड इन टू वीक्स सो फॉर कम्युनिकेशन स्किल एंड व्हेन यू आर इवेल्युएटिंग योरसेल्फ इन कम्युनिकेशन स्किल यू कैन टेक हेल्प फ्रॉम पैम्स रिमेंबर वहां पर एक कंपोनेंट था कम्युनिकेटिंग स्पोर्टिवली रिलेट दिस विद दैट कंपोनेंट सी वेर यू आर नाउ कोई भी स्केल डेवलप कर लीजिए वन टू हंड्रेड वन टू टेन आई लिव इट टू यू लेकिन उस स्केल पर एक ही होगा वेर यू आर नाउ से आउट ऑफ हंड्रेड वेर डू यू वॉन्ट टू रीच इन टू टू थ्री ईयर्स इसका मतलब यह है कि ये जो स्किल्स हैं इनके लिए महीनों और साल चाहिए होंगे आपको अगर आ, कॉन्फिडेंस के साथ अनस्ट्रेसफुल स्माइलिंग फेस के साथ इंग्लिश में प्रेजेंटेशन देनी नहीं आती नो प्रॉब्लम टेक सम कोर्स और राइट यू डोंट वॉन्ट टू पे मनी गो ऑन द वेब फाइंड आउट वेयर दोज पीपल ऑर्गेनाइजेशन कोर्सेज आर अवेलेबल फ्री यू हैव टू टेक इट You have to practice it. Then you have to show it to someone. Okay, please give me feedback. It takes time. इसीलिए मैंने कहा ना, where do you want to reach in two to three years, and where you are now? First, कीजिए मैं अगर आपसे पूछता हूँ communication skill in Chinese, आप मुझसे पूछेंगे मैं भी कहूँगा now zero. Everybody has its own plan. Your plan will be different than mine. Why? 
because my priorities are different than yours right second self awareness where you are now ye to hum kafi discussion bhi kar chuke aapne apne aap ko assess bhi kar liya but even then in the next 2 to 3 years which area you like to even improve further number 3 how do you manage time and stress kaam khatam hi nahi hota kaam ghar lana padta hai वीकेंड पर भी करना पड़ता है फिर भी खत्म नहीं होता अच्छा ये जितना आप काम कर रहे हैं क्या उसका रिवॉर्ड भी मिल रहा है वर्क लाइफ बैलेंस अच्छा फिर चलिए काम तो देखिए काम तो होगा लेकिन काम करते हुए कितने स्ट्रेसफुल होते हैं आप अगर काम स्ट्रेस के एनवायरनमेंट में होगा इट विल हर्ट योर हेल्थ it will hurt your health please think about it and if you will keep on living in a acha fir dekhiye aap ye kahenge ji mujhe kaam hi se stress hota hai well i'm sorry then you have to change your paradigm kaam to karna hai isliye ke allazi khalaqal maut wal hayata liyabluwakum dekhiye let's learn a lesson even quran says الذي خلق الموت والحياه ليبلوكم ايكم احسن عملا i just wanted to see i just wanted to see are you doing good deeds or not are you doing profitable actions or not are you coming with successful skills or not kahin isme mention nahi hai ki duniya ke andar aapko successful nahi hona ahsan amala good deeds good behavior पॉजिटिव एक्शन सक्सेसफुल एक्शन प्रॉफिटेबल एक्शन रबिदनी इलमन ना फैन प्रॉफिटेबल नॉलेज प्रॉफिट तो पार्ट ऑफ द गेम तो लाइफ और डेथ की गेम में जो गुड डीड्स गुड बिहेवियर गुड रिजल्ट गुड परफॉर्मेंस शो करता है सक्सेसफुल तो वही होगा इसके अलावा तो आ, कोई और रास्ता नहीं है अच्छा फिर मेरे लिए और आपके लिए क्या 24 घंटे से ज्यादा को कुछ दिन रात हो जाएगा आई एम सॉरी नॉट इट विल स्टे 24 फोर आवर्स अमेरिका में भी 24 है अलास्का में भी 24 है जहां गर्मियों में 24 घंटे का दिन रात होता है सूरज छिपता ही नहीं सन विल स्टे फॉर ट्वेंटी फोर आवर्स लेकिन वहां भी लोग सोते तो है ना ग्रीनलैंड में जहां सर्दियों में सूरज निकलता ही नहीं है तीन महीने चार महीने सूरज नजर ही नहीं होता तो है सो हाउ आर यू गोइंग टू मैनेज योर टाइम आपका क्या ख्याल है कि वहां कंपनियां काम नहीं करती मुझे किसी ने बताया मैंने अभी कंफर्म नहीं किया कि गूगल के सबसे आ, सबसे जो लार्जेस्ट जो सर्वर प्लेस है थिंक ऑफ द गूगल सर्वर दे आर प्रॉब्लम इन अराउंड ग्रीनलैंड जहां कूलिंग की जरूरत ही नहीं है बारह महीने बर्फ रहती है गर्मियों में भी टेम्परेचर जो है वो आप यू कैन थिंक ऑफ इट नियर द नॉर्थ पोल तो माय डियर स्टूडेंट्स टाइम विल बी ट्वेंटी फोर आवर्स वर्क हैज टू बी फिनिश्ड एंड वर्क रिलेटेड टू योर हेल्थ वर्क रिलेटेड टू योर इंटेलेक्चुअल एनर्जी वर्क रिलेटेड टू अदर्स वर्क रिलेटेड टू एवरी वर्क हैज टू बी गिवन इंपॉर्टेंस बट नॉट स्ट्रेस स्ट्रेस तो फिर ठीक नहीं है विल टॉक अबाउट स्ट्रेस नंबर फोर मोटिवेटिंग एंड इन्फ्लुएंसिंग अच्छा इन्फ्लुएंसिंग के बगैर तो बात नहीं बनती द वे यू स्पीक द वे यू पुट थिंग्स टूगेदर द वे यू आर्ग्यू द वे यू सेल योर प्रेजेंटेशन इन्फ्लुएंसिंग नंबर फाइव हाउ डू यू मैनेज कंफ्लिक्ट एंड कॉम्प्लेक्सिटीज नंबर सिक्स लाइफ एम्स और विजन और सेटिंग गोल्स विद वैलर एंड फॉर ऑनर ये वैलर का लफ्ज मैंने डॉक्टर लगारी की बुक में से लिया है अच्छा वैलर का मतलब क्या है ये दो तीन दफा तो पहले यूज हो चुका है आपने डिक्शनरीज में देखा इसका मतलब क्या है बड़ा टिपिकल लफ्ज यूज किया डॉक्टर साहब ने मुझे भी डिक्शनरी देखनी पड़ी मैं जनरली जब इसको पढ़ाता हूं तो मैं कहता हूं आई यूज इट एज ए सी हाउ ब्रेव यू आर हाउ क्रेजियस यू आर 
Valor mean or courageous you are. Courage is required. And that courage should be that you take care of your honor as well. Apni nazro mein aap ki kitni izzat hai. Sab se pehle to yehi hai. Anyhow, let's move on. Number seven, team building and relationship building. Achha, pe team or groups ke perspective mein woh sare concept aap pad ke aayi honge. Forming and norming and storming. Remember that? To aap agar स्टॉर्मिंग की स्टेज में ही रहते हैं हमेशा किसी भी प्रोजेक्ट पर किसी भी दफ्तर में काम करते हुए किसी भी टीम में काम करते हुए हमेशा स्टॉर्मिंग की स्टेज में ही रहते हैं और नॉर्मिंग में आते ही नहीं तो आई एम सॉरी देन यू वेस्ट ऑल योर टाइम स्टॉर्मिंग तो होगी तूफान तो आएगा जब नए लोग मिलेंगे भाई देखिए जब दो लोग नए मिलते हैं शादी होती है वहां भी तूफान आता है अंडरस्टैंडिंग नहीं होती पर्सनैलिटीज डिफरेंट होती हैं वैल्यूज डिफरेंट होती हैं कल्चर डिफरेंट टू फैमिलीज ज्वाइनिंग हैंड्स टूगेदर बट इफ दैट स्टॉर्म कंटिन्यूज फॉर इयर्स एंड इयर्स एंड इयर्स टीम कहां बनी एक एक दो ग्यारह वो एक ही रहा चाहे वो हस्बैंड है चाहे वो वाइफ है और उसको दूसरे लोग भी फिर देख ही रहे होते हैं फिर बच्चे देख रहे होते हैं उसके बावजूद कुछ लोग लेसन लर्न नहीं करते माफ कीजिएगा उम्र गुजर जाती है वो कहते हैं समझे ही नहीं सो दैट्स वाई वी आर सेइंग हाउ क्विक हाउ मच टाइम यू टेक फ्रॉम स्टॉर्मिंग टू नॉर्मिंग नॉर्मलाइज हो गए वी सेट अवर टारगेट्स वी सेट अवर वैल्यूज हमने लाइन ड्रॉ कर ली भाई देखें आपको इससे आगे नहीं बढ़ना है मुझे इससे आगे नहीं जाना है ठीक है नॉर्मिंग and then comes the performing performance of the family performance of the mother performance of the manager performance of the father starts when things normalize or normalize usi waqt hoti hain jab aap apni values ko apne targets ko apne win win ke circle ko align kar lete hain aur phir ek common circle develop kar lete hain aap bhi ek vector hain aapka colleague ek vector hai हस्बैंड भी एक वेक्टर है वाइफ भी एक वेक्टर है ब्रदर भी एक वेक्टर है दूसरा ब्रदर भी एक वेक्टर है ब्रदर भी वेक्टर है सिस्टर भी वेक्टर है कुलीग्स आर वेक्टर बॉसेस ईच वन ऑफ अस वेक्टर मैंने फिजिक्स से इस्तेमाल किया ईच वन ऑफ अस हैज ए डायरेक्शन एंड हैज ए स्पीड यू चलते रहेंगे तो अलाइनमेंट डायरेक्शनल तो होगी गोल अचीव नहीं होगा वी नीड टू कम एंड मेक दीज सर्कल्स विद सम कॉमन एरिया Join hands together. Maybe become one vector. Longer in length, faster in speed. Anyhow, team concept and relationship building. This is number seven. इसको submit कीजिए कोई भी scale. I leave it to you. Now I think you are competent enough. You can make any scale. Where are you now? And where do you want to reach in two to three years? All right. You will submit. in two weeks time to virtual university my dear students we are getting ready now because this time is now that we would like to learn that all these management skills we were just talking what is the proof that they are important or can we see certain stories of the other managers that yes these skills are important especially the self awareness skill जिस पे हमने इतनी डिस्कशन की आई विल शो यू एंड आई विल प्रेजेंट टू यू एंड आई शेयर विद यू द इंपॉर्टेंस ऑफ दिस लर्निंग ऑफ मैनेजमेंट स्किल्स एंड फ्रॉम द मैनेजमेंट स्किल स्पीकिंग ऑफ द सेल्फ अवेयरनेस एंड परसुएड यू एंड कन्विंस यू एंड डेवलप ए कंसेंसिस विद यू मैंने कहा था ना मोटिवेटिंग एंड इंफ्लुएंसिंग सो आई विल इंफ्लुएंस योर ओपिनियन thinking that yes it's important i'm sharing with you a research paper please read this research paper let me show you the first page this research paper you have to read and this research paper is written by professor edward merritt he has done a research 
And he says, management skill as a predictor of success, a naturally written from a California State Polytechnic University in USA. And success is related here in this paper with income. So in other words, management skill as a predictor of higher income. Padhiye, dekhiye, apne aapko convince kijiye ke dusre log, jisko hum respondents kehte hain, researcher jo hai, jab wo research ko design karta hai, to wo jo bhi uske mind mein baat aa rahi hoti hai, usko ek instrument ke zariye se, respondents se feedback leta hai. So please think about it and see what this professor has done and what is the lesson for you to learn from it so that you can convince that yes, I have to study it. But this paper which you will read, management skill as a predictor of success, management skill as a predictor of higher income. This research paper has achieved three worthwhile purposes. Number one, it enabled us to gain insight. I'm self-awareness. To insight, to management skills, and how they relate to total income. Number two, use summary se many statements li hai. It was possible to utilize theoretical foundations. Dekhi na? Theory to be placed in practice. It was possible to utilize theoretical foundations and rigorous methods to investigate a hunch. Hunch, khayal hai. Jaysa mein kehta hoon, ke if you develop, ye mera hunch hai, if you develop Chinese skill, I think in the time and the month to come, generation Y, probably your salary, your benefits would be higher. Your opportunities would be higher. Ye mera hunch hai. Mere paas koi scientific proof nahi hai. But then you put it scientifically for testing. So we keh rahe it's a proof that wo jo hunch tha ki management skill would be related to higher income. It suggested the relationship among management skills and total income. Proved. Wo hunch jo hai, wo proof ho gaya. Number three, it was possible to develop a model which can be used to measure management and leadership skills in determining how it may relate to total income. How? Now, it can vary from person to person. Which skill to develop? This was developed in US, fine. But would you deny that communication skill is required in Pakistan as well? Would you deny that team building and relationship building is not required uh, in Lahore and it is only required in Karachi? Would you say that uh, relationship building is not important in uh, small towns? It's only for the big town? Balke mujhe dousri tarah se, ke ji, chote gaon mein tar loog ek dousre ko jante hote hain, shahero mein nahi jante, daftar mein nahi jante. Kya ye zaruri nahi hai, knowing others? The third purpose jo is paper se achieve ho raha hai, ke management skills ka, Achha, management or leadership skill, dono ko once again, please remember the model which Dr. Uh, Wheaton and Cameroon have used. What are marketing skills? What are leadership skills? What are management skills? Ye sari jo no skills hain, ye sub management or leadership ko combine kiya unhone to determine how it may relate to total income. So this paper ko aap padhi hai, apne aap ko convince ki jiye. All right, let me move on. I would like to share with you some dilemmas which managers are facing. And reading these scenarios, going through these dilemmas, maybe you will think about it and you will learn a lesson. Let us look at this dilemma. I'll present in front of you two scenarios. And I'll ask answer from you, choice from you. That will be your choice. Then, those students with whom you are sitting in the class, make a group of three or four students. Or, make a group on the net. Three, four, five students, share your answer. Ask others 
why you made this choice and why they are making different choice. But let's take a look on the scenario first. Because for each of these scenarios below, you will select the choice which you think you will take in that situation. Scenario number one. A young female Pakistani manager, a young female Pakistani manager in a high technology firm in Karachi was offered a position by the firm's chief competitor in Lahore for almost double her salary. Her firm in Karachi, now you have to notice that, her firm in Karachi sought to prevent her from changing the job, arguing that her knowledge of certain specialized manufacturing process would give the competitor unfair advantage. Since she had acquired that knowledge through special training in this company and unique opportunities in her current position, the firm is arguing with him, with her that it was unethical for her to accept the competitor's offer from Lahore. Scenario sound me aagya hai? Answer aapko dena hai aur hum, hum sab ka answer mukhtalif hoga. They are arguing it was unethical for her to accept the competitor's offer from Lahore. What should this young manager do? Please give her advice. She should accept the offer or she should reject the offer. Scenario number two. Consumer research company advocated that Wendy's should not advertise its hamburger to be the juiciest. The company indicated that its own test Company ne jo test ki hai, the company indicated that its own test showed different results than the results which they got from the consumers. But the image of the hamburger in the market was the important thing, not the test result which are done in the laboratory by that company. See the difference? Ek test ke result hai. जो 200, 400, 500 उन कंज्यूमर से लिए गए हैं जो उस प्रोडक्ट को उस हैमबर्गर को यूज कर रहे हैं खा रहे हैं और एक वो टेस्ट है जो उस कंपनी ने अपने ही हां किया उनका कहना ये है कि अगर आपने मार्केट के इमेज को देखना है परसेप्शन ऑफ द कंज्यूमर्स इन द मार्केट तो फिर आपको उस टेस्ट को लेना चाहिए उन रिजल्ट्स को कंसीडर करना चाहिए जो आपको मार्केट से मिले शुड दी एडवर्टाइजमेंट ऑन टीवी सीज्ड और नॉट तो अब आपको ये डिसाइड करना है आपका क्या चॉइस है एंड देन आफ्टर गिविंग चॉइस फॉर दी सिनेरियो नंबर टू एंड नंबर वन नो यू प्लीज मेक द ग्रुप एंड डिस्कस द चॉइसेस इन द ग्रुप क्या आपको डिस्कस करना है नंबर वन वाई डिड यू मेक दिस चॉइस जस्टिफाई योर आंसर Number two, what principles or basic values for decision making did you use when you were making that choice? Scenario number one and scenario number two. Number three, what additional information would you need in order to be certain about your choice? Number four, what characteristics might arise to make you change your choice or your mind about your decision? Could there be a different answer to each case in a different scenario, in a different circumstances? Or akhari, your discussion aapko apne group mein karni hai. What does your answers tell you about your own values, about your own cognitive style, about your own attitude towards change, and about your own interpersonal orientation? रिमेंबर यही चारों कंपोनेंट थे सेल्फ अवेयरनेस में आपने जो वो चॉइस किया सिनेरियो के अंदर जो डिसीजन किया उसके पीछे पूरा सेल्फ अवेयरनेस का मॉडल फंक्शन कर रहा था दैट्स व्हाई यू मेड दैट चॉइस 
Now you know why learning that self-awareness was so important. Because decisions have to be made. Choices have to be made. At the personal level, at the organizational level. And while discussing in the group, check it out whether you change your opinion or not. Which way you move in terms of the ethical value, moral value, legal values, or no values at all. Thank you, and thank you very much. And now, I will share with you the dilemmas of certain managers quickly in the next session and show you how the managers face these dilemmas every day and what kind of personalities they have. And I'll ask you to pick out those characteristics and see if you next time see those kind of managers, how would you behave, how would you interact, and how would you react comfortably, successfully, and with valor. Thank you. Thank you very much. Good office.